Hello friends, welcome to Node.js interview question series from Knowledge Powerhouse. Let's go on to our next question in the series. Question is why Node.js is based on single threaded architecture. So Node.js is not a multi-threaded architecture, it's a single threaded architecture. So why exactly is like this? So Node.js is based on single threaded architecture because it runs on Google's V8 engine. And Google's V8 engine, which is used for processing, it is a single threaded architecture based application. So because of this, since Google's V8 engine is single threaded, Node.js application is also a single threaded application. So we have a main loop that keeps on listening. Over the time, single threaded architecture of Node.js has provided much better performance than one thread per request architecture like in CGI we have one thread per request whereas Node.js has a single thread. So because of this better performance also people kept on using Node.js in this kind of an architecture. They never went and tried to create a multi-threaded architecture. Next question is what are the different types of APIs available in Node.js? So Node.js provides some kinds of APIs. What are those? The two categories of APIs from Node.js are synchronous APIs and asynchronous APIs. So synchronous APIs are blocking functions. So they wait for the response to come back. So whenever we call this API, the user has to wait for the response to come back or the client has to wait for the response to come back, which is like in real time. So it's not asynchronous. It's not like fire and forget. Asynchronous APIs, these are non-blocking APIs, these are non-blocking functions and whenever these APIs are called, the processing for the next API will continue and in the background, this API's processing will also continue by the node. So that way user is not blocked and this is called a fire and forget method. So in this, we can get multiple requests and we can just keep storing and sending them for processing to the backend. So that's the asynchronous APIs. So we have a synchronous API and synchronous API in Node.js. 